Hey everybody, Retro Geek Dad here with another toy review. This time we are looking at the Transformers Red Series RC. Um, the red, let's zoom in on it, Robot Enhanced Designs. Now these Transformer, Transformer figures, they do not transform. It's more of just like a articulated action figure really. Um, I picked this up at Walmart online. Uh, for about retail price of $20. Um, it was actually sent in pretty good condition. Uh, I know Walmart's kind of notorious for banging up their stuff when they send it. But uh, they sent it pretty good. Um, this particular RC is from the Transformers Prime cartoon. Um, honestly, and I'm probably going to get some hate comments for this, but I actually like this RC. Um, I liked her in the cartoon. Uh, she did transform into a motorcycle uh, instead of the, you know, the pink car. But uh, yeah, right here on the bottom, non-converting. Uh, she does come with an extra set of hands and then the weapons and stuff. And she also comes with the Energon cube. Here on the back, there's a couple of pictures how to set it up. And just wrap around picture. Uh, UPC code is here on the bottom. So I got focus. There we go. And all the legal stuff on the top. It's just the logo. But uh, we're going to open her up, do a quick review, and check her out. Okay, so let's open up RC. Uh, there is you know, tape on the bottom and tape on the top. I've already cut that. But I'll go ahead and open her up. So you have to open up the top and the bottom. Check that out in a second. And then it opens the rest of piece. It opens up on the side. So the whole thing kind of opens like that, which is pretty neat. Kind of like a little lay out like a book. Here we have accessories and the figure itself. Set those to the side. Let's take a look. A uh, little insert. It's kind of neat. Like a little blueprint almost. And blueprint for the accessories. Let's set that to the side. And a little piece of paper to fill out. I'm assuming it's just a Little warnings. Hasbro sticks in their stuff, yeah. Legal legal stuff. So let's check out RC. Uh, no, no. There is a little uh, string right here. Here is RC. Uh, plastic's a little flimsy. It's like that real soft plastic. Articulation. Her arms are on a ball joint. Elbows. Twist. Bend. Wrists rotate. They do have rockers in them. We have a, there's a joint there, but it doesn't move on the mid-torso. Waist really doesn't turn much. Uh, legs are on a ball joint. The swivel at the hips, the knees, and her toe. <laughs> her toe has an articulation. And then the head is on the ball joint as well. Looks like there's a joint there. Yeah, it doesn't really want to turn. 
face is pretty good. Let's see if I can zoom in on the face. You can see, it looks like she's even got her lips painted. So that's pretty cool. It's a pretty nice figure. Pretty nice. Let's look at the accessories. Um, there's the Energon Cube. Just a solid cube. Energon. And we have these are her little blades that go on her arm. We've got these little they're like blast effects. We've got an extra set of hands. They're closed. Closed fists. Whereas her hands now are the open hands. And some blasters here. So we've got all of that. It's accessories. I'm going to refer to the back of the package as far as getting it set up. Oh, I almost lost the camera. All right, so the blades connect to the bottom. So they have this little, little tiny bitty tab right there. And that plugs into there. This way. So, yeah, so that just kind of plugs in there like that. So we have two of those. That little thing right there wants to kind of get in the way. So let me move it. There we go. Okay, so there are the blades. That and the guns, I think you pop her hands off. Oof, I want to be careful with that. And they look like they plug in. Yep, they plug in there. And there is articulation. There's articulation in the gun. So, I have a gun for each hand. And then this, which on the package, I'm going to zoom it in. On the package, it shows that it's purple, but in reality, it's not. So, it looks like some kind of effect that would, yeah, go onto the sword or the blade. like that which really loses its effect since it's not colored purple it would be much better if it was you know, colored purple but eh. and of course you know we have the closed hands so let's check out the closed hands we'll take all this off yeah I feel that these pieces here the little pegs and the little pegs for the hands those will be the first thing to go just because you have to really pull it to get it out I just I don't yeah see you really have to pull it I don't care too much for that okay so back to the hands um, I just I'm very fearful of that breaking, so I probably won't be changing them much. Um, I'll just go with the standard closed fist, just for display purposes. Ugh. Yeah, I just I really don't care too much for how brittle that is, but all in all, I like it. Um, I like how they've made these Transformers figures that don't transform for people who maybe have a hard time with it. I don't know. But I like it. I like her. 
It's a pretty cool figure. Good articulation. Um, plastic does feel a little flimsy, but it is kind of a small figure. I mean, some of the joints are small. But I think my favorite part of the figure is the toe articulation. I don't think I've ever seen that on a Transformer before, but that is pretty cool. But I hope you enjoyed the video, and we will see you again soon.